so you want to play your PlayStation 5 games remotely on a Windows or a Mac. Here's how you do it. First off, boot up your PlayStation 5 and head over to your console settings. Navigate to system and then remote play and here turn on this remote play option if not already. Now in some cases it might not turn on and if yours is not turning on, this means that your current PS5 is not set as your primary PS5 and you will need to set it as primary to be able to use it with remote play. To do that, head back to the main settings menu and navigate to users and accounts. Scroll down to other and here you will see this feature called console sharing and offline play. Select that and then in here you want to make sure that the console sharing and offline play is enabled. If you have multiple PS5s on a single PlayStation account, you can only have one of them set as your primary PlayStation. And that one only can be used to play remotely. If you ever want to use another one with remote play, you will need to set that another one as primary by going through the same process on that PlayStation. Okay, once you're done with this, the remote play feature should now turn on. Now there's one more setting you need to take care of. For that, we'll go back to the main settings menu, then system, scroll down to power saving, select this option, features available in rest mode. And make sure that this stay connected to the internet and enable turning on PS5 from network is turned on. You need both of these options to be on. This is to make sure that the PlayStation will stay connected to the internet always so that you can access it whenever you want. Now that we did all the required settings on the PlayStation side, let's move over to the computer and fire up the PS Remote Play app. You can get it by clicking on the link in the description box below or simply googling it. So once you install and launch it, you will log in to the same exact PSN account you have on your PS5. Click on confirm and continue. Now on this screen, it is asking you which console you want to connect to. We have a PS5, so we'll click on PS5. Now it's telling us to link our PS5 to Remote Play. Let's click OK and it will try to connect our PS5 through the PSN account because we have a similar PS account on both of these devices. This will most likely connect by itself, but in some cases it doesn't. Well, in that case, it'll prompt you to enter the link device code in a box like this. If you see this, you will head back to your PlayStation 5, go to settings, remote play, link device, and enter the code you see here in the box. And it should connect to your PS5 now. This is all a one-time process. Once this is all set up, you can take your computer anywhere in the world and start playing with a single click, no matter where you are. As long as the PS5 stays in the rest mode and you have a stable internet connection, just make sure not to turn off the PS5 completely, but to put it in rest mode instead. Otherwise, you will need someone to go to your place and turn it on manually for you. That's inconvenient. So the setup is complete and it's time to game now. That's it for today. Give this video a like if this was helpful and also a subscribe would mean a lot to me. If you have any questions or anything to share, let me know in the comments below. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.